This morning in Uvalde, embattled school police chief Pete Arredondo has been fired. All in favor? Motion passes unanimously. Emotions among students and families quickly running high. I have messages for Pete Arredondo and all the law enforcement that were there that day. Turn in your badge and step down. You don't deserve to wear one. Our babies are dead. Our teachers are dead. Our parents are dead. The termination comes exactly three months after a gunman claimed the lives of 19 children and two teachers at Robb Elementary. Brett Cross, the uncle and guardian of Uzziah Garcia, says victims like Uzziah deserve justice. He's never going to graduate from high school. He's never going to have his first date, his first car. None of that. He will forever be 10 years old. Though absent from the meeting, Arredondo having his say in a lengthy 17-page statement sent to the school board, his lawyer accusing the board of an unconstitutional public lynching, writing the board has not followed proper procedure and refuses to provide a written complaint against Arredondo, adding none of his decisions or actions demonstrate a failure to meet the accepted standards of conduct for law enforcement officers in similarly situated school districts in Texas. Arredondo has faced widespread scrutiny for the delayed response to the shooting. Officials say it took authorities 77 minutes to engage the shooter. The shots have come in through that wall, just so you know. The Texas legislature releasing a fact-finding report last month, faulting the police response for egregiously poor decision-making, adding officers failed to prioritize saving the lives of innocent victims over their own safety. In that report, Arredondo telling the committee he didn't consider himself the incident commander. But Uvalde families glad to see some results even three months later. We did something. We got something accomplished finally. And no word yet on whether Arredondo plans to appeal uh, this decision. His attorney yesterday afternoon calling for him to be reinstated with back pay and benefits. We did reach out to both Arredondo and his attorney after this decision was announced, but have not heard back. Hoda? Yeah, Priscilla, it's so hard to believe it took three months for some action to happen there. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.